Right guys, welcome back. With today's video, we are going to show you this broken formation in FIFA 23. If you're not using it, you need to get using it. Trust me, it will change everything you do. It is just so, so smooth. It's solid at the back. You get players going forward. It is just quality. So, we'll start with the formation. <coughs> We've got the 4-2-2-2. Two, two, two. Nah. It is, it's just solid in every way possible. We'll come on to the instructions towards the end, but the tactics to start off with. So we leave the defensive uh, style as balanced. Keep your width at 50 and get your depth at 65. Build up play. I have this at slow, just so you can keep your passing. Uh, passing it around nice and easy. And then your chance creation balance is what I have it on. If you like to be a bit more direct, then obviously you direct passing, but I have balance. It mixes it up a little bit. Your forwards make the runs in behind um, and stuff like that. Your width at 60. Players in the box, I like to have that on six. Uh, you'll see I have midfielders running into the box and stuff for crosses. Corners and free kicks, we just have it on two. Uh, I'm sure you all know the little corner glitches and stuff you can do, so realistically you only need one man in the box on your corners if you're going to make it work instructions this is where it gets key so we'll start with left back right back you want to get them joining the attack and overlapping and you want uh, the defensive position set to step up and that is with both of them both of them exactly the same center backs you just want obviously them staying back everything on default with both of them when it comes to your CDMs, so we've got Kante left side. We have literally he is default everything. Leave him as normal. He'll get involved. He'll defend. He will just Kante is the man. He's a box to box man. He does everything for you. Sissoko on the other end, because we've got our left back right back to get forward on the attack. Um, we have him his attacking support. Obviously, drop between defenders. So when you uh, left back right back get forward. You've still got three at the back then. It will automatically slot in as a centre-back. Um, have him to cover the centre. Everything else is default. Cams. Get into the box for crosses. Like I mentioned. Uh, players in the box for crossing. Um, and free roam positioning. He'll find the space himself. He'll drop into those little holes for you. And the other side exactly the same again. Get into the box and free roam. Strikers, uh, left hand side we've got stay central and stay forward, attacking runs is default and interceptions is default, and again exactly the same the other side, absolute works like a dream, trust me. So, your four two two two. you've got your instructions, tactics like I say, you can uh, switch your chance creation. It's potentially even switch your build up if you want it to be a bit more fast paced. But I like to take my time, pass it around between your midfield defenders, just create that little gap, get your right back overlapping, and then bosh, we're through. Um, but trust me, guys, if you're not using it, you need to be using this. But honestly, I, I can't praise it enough. It works like an absolute dream. Let me know how you get on. If you think you've got a better formation, let me know in the comments and uh, we'll try it out, we'll test it. But for me so far, this is by far the best formation we've come across. Cheers guys, I'll speak to you all next time. Have a good one.